Okay, let's start the normal. Chord spacing. Between 1 and 2 is A. Between 2 and 3 is B. Between 3 and 4 is C. Between 4 and 5 is D. Between 5 and 6 is E. A, B, C, D, E. Okay, I'm going to show you my six strand setup, and I have to do it fairly quick because remember, guys, I'm without power here in Puerto Rico after the hurricane. Uh, so let me do it really quick. <clears throat> First thing I'm going to do is about six foot strand. I'm going to go in the bottom around the two nails that I always set up for my Mad Max. I go over and down the center. Then I'm going to go down the center, back through the same nails. Then I go around, I loop back, and I'm going to go back through the middle. And I'm going to do pretty similar like the four strand. So then I'm going to grab the cord, go in between, down A, or up A, behind the cord itself and then form the loop. I'm going to come up, C, to the left of this cord, which is itself, and then go through the loop. Then once again, I'm going to pull the nail out, get it ready, and put it back. Just remove the bottom cord. So it will be something like this. Now here's where I adjust the cords and get them to the outside. Then I pull. When I come to the end, you're basically going to reach all the way to the bottom and just leave enough space for this cord to go through. And that's it, guys. Now I'm going to show you a new bracelet. Okay, so the way I'm going to start this bracelet is that I'm going to go down B with the accent cord and down D. Okay, first thing I'm going to do is grab my right cord. I'm going to go under, out through C, and I throw it over. I'm going to keep it underneath the left side of the cord. All right, now I grab my left cord. I'm going to go over this cord, under, out through C, above the right side of the cord. And that looks scary. Okay. Now the whole trick is this. I'm going to go down the right loop. And the right cord is going to go down the left loop. So that's the way it should look. Okay. Next thing I'm going to do is grab the left cord. I'm going to go over, down through C and out through this loop on the left. And it should look something like that. I'm gonna grab my right cord. I'm forming this little loop and that's where it goes through. I'm gonna go down C and out through the right side of that loop we formed. Okay, now the pulling is going to be from the top part of that cord. So we're going to push it up and pull. It's going to look like that. Tighten it up. You pull. And if you hear voices in the background, it's just that there's people and I don't have AC and I don't have any light. Then I pull on this cord and make sure it's underneath this loop over here.
Okay, that's our first knot. Let's do one more. Actually, let's do two more before I lose power and then I need to recharge again. I'm going to grab my right cord. I'm going to go under, out through C, and remember, I'm going to go below the left cord. Okay, I'm going to grab my left cord. I'm going to go out through C also, above the right cord, and down through the loop on the right. Okay, we tighten up a little bit. I'm going to grab my left cord. I'm forming the loop here. I'm going to go down C and out the loop on the left. I'm going to form my loop again on the right side. I'm going to go down C and out the loop on the right. Okay, tighten up a little bit, and remember, we're going to pull from here, where we formed the loop. That's to tighten up. So we pull fairly tight, push up, and then we're going to pull the cord again. And remember, it has to be tightened below this loop over here. Let's do one more. I'm going to go under, out through C. I'm going to go underneath the cord on the left. I'm going to grab our left cord. We're going to go under, out through C, and above the cord on the right, and down through the loop on the right. Gonna grab our left cord, forming our loop here on the left. Gonna go down C and out through the loop on the left. And it's gonna look like that. I'm gonna form the loop over here. I'm holding it here. I'm gonna go down C and out through the loop on the right and one more time it's going to look like that and once again i'm going to pull these cords over here that's to tighten up tighten up pretty good and then we pull Okay, continue to the end of the bracelet. Okay, I did it the other color, um, but I'm gonna show you the, remember I said, leave enough room for one loop. Um, you're gonna use about 13 feet of black cord. Uh, you're gonna use six feet for your core. All right, and then we just put the fed, take it down both cords, See, it's in between. Grab the other cord. I created this little fid from one of the videos on YouTube. I use it for tight spots. All right, now we're going to tighten this one, and tighten this one, get it nice and tight. Okay, there's our bracelet. Okay, till the next one. Actually, this is going to be my final video. Uh, I'm going to be just doing private ones. So, 
I'll talk about that later.